thinking about moving to Fort Lauderdale, Florida, in this video, I'm going to show you the best gated communities in the area. Let's get after it right now. So this gated community is called the Enclave. Now the Enclave is located and surrounded by the Coral Ridge Country Club. The views that they have are the Reese 9, just to give you an idea. They're very nice, new, beautiful, modern architecture throughout. They come in different sizes and styles. Some are 4,000 square feet, 8,000 square feet, 15,000 square feet, and they cost in the multi-millions. They originally started in the low millions, like three, five, seven, and now you're looking closer to eight, nine, 10, even 15 million, depending on the size. It's very, very exclusive. It is gated, it is manned 24 seven. Um, and it is very limited housing. So if you are in this neighborhood, great, lucky for you, beautiful home. You can still end up owning here. There is some new construction going on um, and there's just a couple still left for sale. And then at that point it's just resale, but look at how gorgeous these homes are picturesque. Only a privileged few have the rare opportunity to share in the security, privacy, and elegance of living in this community on a 22-acre site that is surrounded by the Reese 9 golf course designed by Robert Trent Jones. There are only 36 homes in total, to give you an idea in price range, a home that is 6,100 square feet, six bedroom, six and a half bath, you would be looking at $8 million. A home that's about 7,600 square feet, five bed, six and a half bath, would be $12 million. And the quarterly HOA is 3,150, which does include the security. So that would be $1,050 a month. Now this is new construction. So as I mentioned, if you are still interested in living in this community, it's not too late. The next best gated community in Fort Lauderdale that we are gonna go inside of is Bay Colony. Let's go. If this is your first time to the channel and you wanna know everything about Fort Lauderdale, Florida and the surrounding areas, then make sure to subscribe down below and tap on the bell for notifications so you're the first to be notified about the current real estate market in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. My name is Adela Philipson. We get calls, texts, and emails every day from people just like you looking for help to make a move to Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Whether it's nine days or 90 days, give us a call, shoot us a text, or send us an email. All the information is down below in the description so we can help you move to Fort Lauderdale, Florida and the surrounding areas. So this is Bay Colony. We are inside. Not only do they have the armed guard man gated uh, at the entrance, but they also have patrol uh, going you know around the community so it's very safe it's very quiet as you can see behind me water access to the intracoastal waterway gorgeous luscious homes located here in Bay Colony this community was developed in the 60s but what's unique about this community is that every single property is a waterfront property and all of them do have as i mentioned direct access to the intro coastal waterway now there are just a little over a hundred homes in this community and as i had previously mentioned not only is it man and gated they are armed guards and there is security patrol 24 7 in the area in terms of pricing a home that's about 7100 square feet six bed seven and a half bath you would be looking at 8.5 million also one directly on the intracoastal waterway that's 9100 square feet six bed six and a half bath is 20 million the quarterly hoa fees is about 1700 which equates to 566 dollars a month 
since the community was developed in the 60s you will have a mix of older homes as well as modern homes so depending on what you're looking for there is a lot to choose from We're checking out our last gated community here in Fort Lauderdale. Believe it or not, this is one of Fort Lauderdale's best hidden secrets. It's Sea Ranch Lakes and it is its own city within Fort Lauderdale. Let's go check it out. This small city features just over 200 homes. Not only does it have its own police force, but also its own mayor and city hall. The city was developed in the 60s, so you do still have that mix of old homes as well as newer homes. To give you an idea of pricing, if you wanted a home that's 3,500 square feet, six bed, four bath, dry lot house, that would be 2.5 million. Unless you want to be on an intracoastal waterway, that would be a 6,200 square foot home, five bed, four and a half bath for 11 million. They do also have homes on that lake there. The HOA fees are $1,300 a quarter, which equates to $325 a month. That was a great community. Now let's go check out the private beach club, only available to residents. If you did find that information valuable, make sure to hit the like button. And if you want to learn more about Fort Lauderdale and the surrounding areas, then make sure to subscribe down below. And don't forget to tap on that bell for notifications. See you around town.